What I love about Lori is that she is who she is. She is comfortable in her own skin. She um, is a soft place to land when I come home. And she has always been supportive and loving. And I love you. What I love most about Courtney Phelps is her creativity and her ingenuity. She's a remarkable woman, and my life has been bettered because of her. What I love about my husband, Andy, is the same thing that I loved about him when I agreed to marry him, was that I knew we could get through anything together, including multiple appointments, multiple kids, multiple degrees. I love Andy. about Rachel is her dedication and love for her family, especially to our kids, and that she is passionate and bold about what she believes in and wants to make this world a better place. There's a lot that I love about my spouse, Leanne Johnston. There's really nothing that she can't do, uh, I found, but also she has supported every wild move that we've made in ministry, including our latest, uh, starting a brand new church. It just, I really couldn't do any of this without her. What I love about, love about my spouse uh, is that he is absolutely cute. He is absolutely cute. <laughs> Yeah, and uh, it's very supportive, so faithful, and I just wouldn't be here without him. Like his support, so he's great. He looks great. Love you, honey. What I love about Melissa is she has always found a way to make everywhere we've served home and to make it a home church for the, our kids and for our family. Um, she's also found her way to serve everywhere that we have been. Uh, Melissa, I love you and happy Valentine's Day. I met my husband Jeff Murphy at the pew of a church in our um, when we were at college in Granville, Ohio. Little did I realize on that day that he was one of the angels that was going to accompany me to fulfill a call that had been put on my heart for, when I was 14 years old. Jeff Murphy stood beside me and has gone from appointment to appointment with me. And as I leave every church, they're like, well, Cheryl, we're, we're sorry to see you leave. You know, pastors come, pastors go, praise God. But can Jeff Murphy stay here? Can he remain with us? I can't imagine my ministry without him. He's been beside me all the way, and I absolutely adore him, and I'm grateful for him. We're working on number 41, and I'm thrilled to have him beside me each and every day. What I love about Bria is she's one of the most generous people I know. She's always willing to help uh, everyone that she meets, no matter how well she knows them. She is always willing to be supportive in ministry. She allows me to do all the things that I feel called to do without uh, telling me no. So <laughs> I'm grateful to her for that. What I love most about my wife, Maria Dixon Hall, is that she is amazingly compassionate, kind, patient, understanding, and loving person. She is a brilliant mom to our kids, an exciting scholar, an inspiring leader, and a brilliant Christian who shows me every day the way of grace. What I love about Kelly is his uh, desire to be a partner in ministry with me, and I especially love the way he chauffeurs as we drive around the beautiful East District. What I appreciate about my spouse is his very generous heart and the fact that he understands my job. I appreciate my wife because she has me cough in the morning without having to get up. So. And she's there for me when I've got tough times. So that, that's the majority of the marriage. We're there together for each other. Eli is uh, the person who uh, makes me a better person each and every day. She, uh, she inspires me to be the best version of myself. She's thoughtful and kind. And most importantly, uh, she loves 
our children. She loves me and she loves others in such unconditional ways. And that um, allows me to be the best version of myself and the best minister to my people. I am very grateful. I love her dearly. Sundre. What I love about Sundre is, first of all, to me, is she's a gorgeous person. I love uh, her strong will, her willpower, and how she makes our home a loving home. I love my husband because he is like Jesus to me. He taught me about unconditional love, and he is so calm and supportive and kind and generous. He's a wonderful husband. What I love about my wife, Evelyn, is that she's so kind and generous and she always has this big smile that makes people feel good about themselves. What I appreciate about my husband, Patrick Hoffman, is his sense of justice and compassion and his loyalty and how he makes me London songs every morning. There are so many things that I love and appreciate about Jen, but the thing that's coming to mind right now is the fact that she can walk into a room and her smile just lights up the entire place. What I love about Tammy is that uh, she's strong and she's confident and she's nearly always right. I hate to say that, but it is true. And she is a great wife and mother and she's a tremendous grandmother. So I enjoy spending my life with her and I'm gonna spend the rest of it with her. What I love about my Reggie is that he is the greatest encouragement. He believes me when I don't believe in myself and he has shown me true love. Uh, and he also picked up my outfit. Hey, hey, I love you. Love you, babe. <laughs> <That's what I'm laughs> saying. I love Kyler because I carry a 40 ounce Stanley and I don't like stale water. And every single time I ask for new ice and new water, sweet Kyler refills it for me. What a gift. What I love about my wife Liliana is that she is very generous with her friends, with her family, with me, and also very caring. I just love my wife Sylvia Wang. I just love the way she looks up to me, and she's just been a perfect partner for marriage and in ministry as a clergy couple. So I just think she's fantastic. Unfortunately, she will not get her seafood Alfredo on Valentine's Day because I have an Ash Wednesday service. What I love about him is that so he's the best preacher's wife that ever was. I love my wife and she is the wonderful gift that God has given me and my partner in ministry and I thank God for that. What I love about Andrew is that he always worries about the worst case scenario so the rest of us can just have fun and he's a great dad to our girls. My wife's name is Sochil, which is an Aztec name for flower and and I'm Owen so Sochil, Owen, XO, Valentine's, XO. And what I am so thankful for with my wife is she is willing to get up on Sundays and travel anywhere to visit any church and help load up our two boys and so she has been in more churches of the united methodist of the north texas conference than any pastor besides me and i'm so thankful that she just helps make my work just a blessing and my sundays even more blessed What I love about Chris is just the way that he's got endless energy uh, that comes my way in the form of unconditional support. When I've had a bad day, he's there. When I need a cheerleader, he's there. He's my partner in every way. It's a blessing. What I love about Robbie is that he is fun and funny and supportive and um, I love being with him. My favorite person. I love Nikki because one, she laughs at my jokes. 
but most importantly, she's a great partner in life and in ministry, and uh, I couldn't imagine doing it without her. Hi, Maya. Um, happy Valentine's Day. This is our 42nd Valentine's as a married couple and 45 in total since we've known each other. So I love you and I just want to let you know how much I appreciate all of your support, your prayers, and your companionship over all of these years. And remember, I've got you, babe.